Hello and welcome back. So we're looking at a mobile hotspot from AT&T and this is the Nighthawk uh, model number MR6110 and it's made by Netgear as you guys can see right here and it's branded AT&T so um, we'll go ahead and disconnect the USB type C charger from the device and show you what it looks like it's a small portable device easy to carry with you in your vehicle or let's say you're attending an, an event and you need to have Wi-Fi broadcast to your different set of equipment and crew this will make a very good unit to have uh, with you so for connectivity you have one USB type C and then you have an Ethernet connector right here also you have two ports which are kind of tricky which you can use to put in uh, physical antennas to boost your reception. Let's go ahead and close those. On the front you have this screen which is uh, 2.4 inches. It's a touch screen LCD panel. You have the button here to turn on the unit so let's go ahead and turn it on. Uh, we get this message that a SIM card is not involved. So that is not installed. So it's a touch screen as you guys can see. Let's go to the home page. And that's what the home page looks like. Oh my gosh, sorry. The unit has a 5040 milliamp hour battery installed and it's powered by a Qualcomm SDX65 chipset. You have the regular Wi-Fi and you can also program the unit to have a guest Wi-Fi. The type of Wi-Fi that it uses is Wi-Fi 6 with speeds up to 3.6 gigabytes per second. It's also capable of using 5G. So for the 5G, uh, it uses SOP 6. For the SIM card, it takes a nano SIM card. Let's go ahead and open the unit here so you guys can see what it looks like behind there's a little notch right there you can pull down and that's what the back of the unit looks like and if you pull the battery you can see where the nano sim card goes it's a lithium ion battery 5040 milliamp hour let's close that up that just snaps in place go ahead and turn on the unit on the 2.4 gigahertz and also on the 5 gigahertz frequencies it uses WPS for security all in all, it's a very good unit, I think. Uh, it has been sup superseded by other more powerful units, but given that it uses uh, Wi-Fi 6 and would broadcast on two frequencies, it makes it a very powerful unit to have with you in case you have many uh, devices that have to connect on, uh, get on the internet. So there you have the display on this uh, front page. You can go to the settings. You have an airplane mode. Airplane mode is on. You can turn that off. Let's go back. Mobile broadband. You have the screen, you can change the brightness. Language. 
software you can update the software and here you have the factory reset in case you want to reset the whole unit the APN you have to put that in from your carrier domestic data so just this is just to showcase the unit so you guys can uh, in case you see a static picture you can have an idea what it feels like if you have it in your hand thanks for watching catch you guys on the next one bye